Kieran Moffat here from the Mighty Tauri Eels. We're taking on Varsity this weekend in the Premier Final. I'm here with Aki. Uh, he's uh, one of our props. So what are your thoughts on the week build-up for the final? Um, it's pretty uh, relaxed at the moment. Um, thought it, uh, we'd uh, sort out the uni stuff at the start of the week and then for the rest of the week just worry about us and get our get our jobs right and focus on our game. Now we're actually at Tauri College here late at night. Do you make a habit of hanging around schools late at night? Oh yeah, always. <laughs> Dark alleyways? Yeah, definitely. You Can I def watch uh, police this <laughs> <laughs> um, And uh, in Tama Turangi in the last game of playing against uh, Varsity, put on a, quite a massive shot on you. Um, how has he got you back since then? Oh, I wouldn't say it was a big shot. Um, you know, it was uh, wet conditions and um, it'll be a change of story once we are under the under the roof of our Forsyth Bar, so yeah. Um, gutter guys were actually telling me that uh, you, you've been seeing one of his girls or he's been seeing one of your girls. Tell me a bit of story about that. Oh, um, gutter guys is uh, full of it, to be honest. Right, uh, have we got a score prediction for the weekend? Uh, I'm going to go uh, us up uh, 13 plus. Oh. Heard it here first. Um, Mike Collins here from Gutter Guys. Uh, just tell me a wee bit about the business and uh, how long you guys have been going. Successful? Gutter Guys, oh, extremely successful. Gutter Guys was uh, founded a couple of years ago. Obviously kicked off the last, oh, probably last six months after a mate won a, won a scratchy, so he bought us some some tops. And yeah, if you need any, need any property maintenance done, need any students out there with their holes in their, holes in their walls or uh, windows broken, give us a yell. We'll be uh, more than happy to get in touch. Uh, fantastic, and you also play a wee bit of rugby on the side as well. Um, how's that going at the moment? Yeah, good. We kicked off kicked off on Monday yesterday, so now it's good good to get a squad together and um, yeah, really enjoying everyone's company. Uh, we've actually been going for quite a few weeks, Mikey. Uh, I was actually talking about the Tyre Eels, um, but this guy's obviously up in his own weird cloud here. So big final this weekend, apparently. Um, well, how do you think that one's going to go? Yeah, good twist of words, well played, well played. <laughs> okay, absolute dick. Uh, final, yeah, no, it's, it'll be it'll be good. Get um, we've always had good close games with the university, so it'll be good to play play those guys. Here, yeah, Matt Fettis is um talking up pretty big games, so he's known to choke a few new few finals. So um, yeah, it'll be interesting how he goes. And uh, you're looking forward to marking Fletcher Smith? Yeah, Fletch. He's uh, played a bit of rugby with him through school, so now it'll be it'll be an enjoyable wee challenge. How are you planning on betting him? On beating Fletcher, uh, I think we'll probably play around him. I think at the at the moment, he um, yeah, he's playing pretty good rugby at the moment. So the more we can isolate those sort of guys and and play around them, manipulate them, we would. I think we might have a wee shot. Yeah, and because you were saying he was quite weak on that open shoulder as well. Yeah, well, he's Fletcher. He's we he is known to shy away a wee bit. So you know, we'll get you running through that channel. I'll be a good decoy. Beautiful. Look forward to it. Hey, uh, score prediction for this weekend, mate. Score prediction twenty twenty seven twenty five. Sorry. Oh, close one. Drop yeah. goal? Yeah, I've, oh, I don't know if you saw my crossfield kick on the weekend, but that was pretty good, so I could probably have had a drop goal, I reckon. <laughs> uh, big fizz, big fitzy. Uh, big week ahead for you. Looking forward to uh, coming off the bench with a bit of venom. Yeah, mate, looking forward to it. Big game, big finals, so yeah. Nah. And how have you been enjoying the Eels environment? Um, no, nah, it's all good bunch of lads and stuff, and... Um, Good team vibes and stuff, so yeah. We'll take it back to uh, back to the uni, um, not not the rugby club. We're talking about uni. Um, you're in a, you're in pretty good nick. How do you go with the ladies? Uh, I don't know. I thought this was a rugby chat, but um, oh yeah, no, it's been going alright, mate. Not too bad. Can we, uh, get, can we get some numbers? Uh, no, nah, I wouldn't put numbers out there, eh? Uh, what about Rio week? How'd you get on Rio week? Yeah, pretty good. Um, lots of study done, and um, yeah, turned out to train in the morning and stuff. So it was pretty, pretty good week. Yeah, nice, nice. And uh, moving right along, um, who do you think's the biggest threat for the varsity pack? Um, in their four pack, yeah. Um, Sione, he's pretty. Um, if they, he gets front foot ball and stuff, you know, they they go off him quite a bit. So um, also Sturgy, those two are pretty, um, pretty up there for their forwards. Eh? So yeah. And you're openly racist, so how are you going to um, come, uh, come up against <laughs> Sione and Tama? Um, to be honest, mate, colour of the skin's not really, um, I'm not too worried about that, but um, look, mate, I just look at them as rugby players rather than anything else. <laughs> <laughs> right, 
And, uh, and a score prediction for on Saturday, mate? Um, I'm going uh, 33-25 Eels. Awesome. All right, we've got... Uh, well, I can't even count. We've got three, uh, three other guys talking tonight, all picking the Eels. Uh, I'm going to be the fourth here. I'm going to back uh, Aki, and we're going to win 13+. plus. Cheers, mate.